How to apply eyeliner Eyeliner can accentuate your eyes with a soft line or a dramatic stroke. You can embellish your eyes by spending just a few minutes in front of a mirror with an eyeliner pencil, some liquid liner, or a gel liner. Even if you are new to wearing eyeliner, you can learn all about how to apply it in just a few minutes. Applying liquid liner Shake the liner To ensure that the liquid liner is well mixed, you will need to shake the bottle. Make sure that the lid is secured first and then shake the liquid liner for a few seconds. When you are ready, unscrew the cap and pull the brush out of the bottle. If the brush seems to have too much liner on it, then swipe it across the edge of the liner bottle. Start in the middle. Place the brush against your upper lash line so that it is as close as possible to your eyelashes. Then, begin applying eyeliner to your upper lash line. Move out towards the outer edge of your lash line. If you are worried about getting an even line, you can line your upper lash line with pencil liner first and then go over this line with liquid liner. Fill in the gaps. After you have finished lining the outer corner, line the inner edge of your upper lash line and connect this line up with the first line you made. Use small strokes to connect your lines and fill it out as needed so that you have one solid, even line on your upper lash line. If you make a mistake, Dip a cotton swab in some makeup remover and use the tip of the cotton swab to fix it. You can wipe away excess liner or even out a crooked edge. Follow lower lash line for a winged look. Wings are optional with liquid liner, but adding wings can intensify your look. If you want to create a winged look, then just follow the curve of your outer lash line upwards form the outer corner of your eyelid. Then, fill in the wing as needed. Try creating just a small wing if you do not want to look too dramatic, or go for a longer wing for a high drama look. You can use the edge of a business card to help you create a straight line for the wing. Just place the business card against the outer edge of your eyelid at an angle and trace along the edge with a liquid liner. You can also use tape to create wings. Place some tape on your lower lash line so that it is at an angle. The tape should be right up against the outer edge of your lower lash line and extending up towards your eyebrow. You can tilt the tape as much or as little as you want, but keep in mind that more tilt will look more dramatic. If you want a less dramatic look, reduce the amount of tilt in your tape. Applying Pencil Liner Apply liner to one side of the liner brush. Gel line usually comes in a small pot and you will need a liner brush to apply it. When you are ready to apply your liner, unscrew the lid from the pot and dip your liner brush into the gel liner so that just the tip or edge is coated in gel liner. Gel liner can dry out quickly, so make sure that you replace the lid as soon as you are done using it. If I seems a little dry or stiff, then you may also want to warm the pot in your hands to make it easier to use. Start at your inner and outer corners. Begin applying the gel liner to your inner lash line moving towards the center, but do not fill it in yet. Then, apply some liner to your outer lash line moving towards the outer edge. If your eyelids tend to cover up your eyeliner, then apply the liner in an arch shape. This will help to ensure that you can see the liner when your eyes are open. Another option is to create several dots along your lash line and then connect the dots to create a line. Fill in the center. After you have starter lines on the inner and outer edges, then you can fill in the gap along the center of your lash line. Use soft small strokes to create an even line along your upper lash line. To ensure that the line is even, you may need to go over it several times. Get some more gel liner on your brush if needed. You may be able to complete one eye with the amount of gel liner that you applied to your brush or you can add more if needed. Try blending some eyeshadow along the edge of the liner to create a smoky or smudged effect. Creating a smoky cat eye look. Create a base. Apply a neutral tone of eyeshadow to your eyelids to begin and then follow it up with a slightly darker color. For example, you can use a nude shade, followed by a light brown shade. Use a fluffy brush to apply each layer of the eyeshadow all over your eyelids. 
add eyeshadow to the outer edges of your eyelids. Next, apply some medium brown eyeshadow to the outer edges of your eyelids. This will start to enhance your outer eyelids and create a nice backdrop for your cat eye eyeliner. Follow up the medium brown shade with some black eyeshadow over the same area. Apply some black eyeshadow to the inner edges of your eyelids as well. This will help to create the smoky effect. Highlight the center. To brighten your eyes, add a bit of light, shimmery eyeshadow to the centers of your eyelids. You can use any light, shimmery color that you want, such as a champagne, cream, or white color. Pat the eyeshadow onto the centers of your eyelids using a small fluffy brush. Line your upper lash line. Now that you have finished applying your eyeshadow, you can start to line your upper lash line with black eyeliner. Take the eyeliner and begin by applying it to the outer and inner edges of your upper eyelids, then fill in the center. If you are using gel liner with a liner brush, then make sure that the brush is evenly coated and that there are no clumps of liner stuck on the brush. Create your wings. Next, extend your eyeliner out past the edge of your eyelid and upwards. Follow the curve of your lower lash line to help you create the wings. Then, fill in the area between the center of the wing and the liner on your eyelids. When you are done, you should have a dramatic, thick-looking cat eyeliner look. Apply mascara and false lashes. You can finish your look with some mascara and false lashes if desired. Adding mascara will help to define your eyes and false lashes will give you an even more dramatic look. Try curling your lashes before you apply mascara to give them some extra volume and definition.